hi. The white-tailed sea eagle is Europe's largest bird and we've been to see them off the west coast of Scotland. They are really awesome. My eye was caught by this article in the British Medical Journal earlier this year. It describes eagle syndrome, which was first written about by Dr. Watt Weems Eagle in 1937. Great name. He was an American ENT doctor. And in these cases, the styloid bone is too long and it can cause compression of the internal carotid artery, tearing it, and that isn't good. This can create neck pain and associated headache. What characterizes Eagle syndrome additionally are difficulty swallowing and pain in the throat. Sometimes it's triggered by tonsil removal surgery. Rarely in cases of Eagle syndrome, there can be nerve compression causing changes of the eye pupil sizes known as Horner's syndrome and drooping of one of the eyelids called ptosis. Now, lots of patients do come to us with neck pain and associated headache, but I don't think in my 33 years of practice, I've ever seen a case of Eagle syndrome yet. <laughs> to cure it, the styloid bone needs surgery. Now, thanks to these authors for a fantastic case study. Maybe we will get to see some white-tailed sea eagles when we go back to Scotland this summer. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.